It's incredible, really, isn't it? It's chaos in Westminster. <laughs> we should have this referendum. Well, when Gordon Brown said we were going to have a referendum before he sneaked off to a little back room somewhere and signed a bit of paper all by himself. <laughs> right, not only, not only did the Brexit vote come through and then David Cameron went, all right then, we've got to do it and I'm resigning. <laughs> I mean, that was astounding in itself. I never saw that going. Now... Now, Boris Johnson, the tip successor to lead the Tory party and be Prime Minister, has said he's not going to challenge for Prime Minister. <laughs> I, this isn't the way it's supposed to work. William Hague was tipped as a Tory leader when he was about 16. Right? He stepped up. Even though the Tory party was an absolute shambles, not elected, to power, he stepped up, right? That's the way it's supposed to go, right? Gordon Brown took over from Blair when the Labour Party was collapsing faster than a house of cards in a brothel, right? <laughs> That's, that was the order. That was what was supposed to happen, so they did it. They don't care about the people. So that's what they did. And then, and then Darling, who looks like one of the Muppets, he became Chancellor because that's the way it's supposed to go. Because this, all this was organised like 20 fucking years ago, right? <laughs> and Boris was selected at the same time as Cameron, like 20, 25 years ago, because he was going to be a future Prime Minister. That's how he got so high in the Tory party, because it's a career, kids. It's not a fucking, it's not a job to help the, the public. It's not, it's not a, a, a what do you call it, a, a vocation. It's a career. Politics is a fucking career, and they start either in the council or as little councillors, and they make their way up the chain. And I saw that happening when I was a councillor. And in fact, one of the county council managers went on to Whitehall from Cambridge, just to let you know. And now, it's fucking chaos. Right? Lib Debs collapsed. Well, whatever that election was, and they got kicked out. Labour collapsed because they lost fucking Scotland, so they're half the party they were, right? Fair enough, I said at the time, the Tories are in trouble now because they're the only main party left, they're the ones going to be in the firing line, but fuck me. <laughs> they're going down faster than the fucking Titanic. <laughs> and by the way, if you want Theresa May as Prime Minister, I can only suggest psychological help. <laughs> this is this is fucking beautiful. This is the collapse of Westminster. This is a whole new fucking era. The Tory vote's going to collapse. I'll tell you what's going to happen now. The Tory vote's going to collapse. UKIP are going to take all the votes. Labour are going to join them in a coalition. And that's what's going to be the next government. There you go. You heard it here first. <laughs> It's fantastic. I've never seen carnage like it. And, and I've followed politics for about 20 years. <laughs> it's beautiful! <laughs> anyway, I was, I've got another video to do. So I shall see you later on, kids.